billionaire's marriage episode minus two. But Emma, a story had only just begun. In all honesty she had never realized she was so brave. She had actually married a stranger. And what was done was done. There was no pints in regrets. She returned to her car. Just as she was about to start the engine and head home. She received a phone call from Nathan. Emma, where are you right now? Out in front of City Hall, about to go home. Emma replied casually, keeping her voice calm. Amber has a very important show, and I need you to fill in for her right away. I'll tell the makeup artist to provide you with a mask. No one will be able to tell it's you. He was clearly talking to her as her boss, not as her fiancé. Since Amber is injured, think you'll have to take this on. Didn't you say Amber got hurt on stage? If so, the media should already know she is injured. True, but I've three told them that she's still going to show up, even with her injuries. I have told you what I need you to do, so just do it. He was absolutely shameless in the past, Emma had done stupid things like this for Amber Dot without even realizing she was being used, but she WS and single quote he going to do it anymore. Emma stayed calm, at least on the outside, she said, okay, let me know the time and address. And, I'll head over there now. Thank you, Emma. You and I are about to get married, and Amber's star is on the rise. You can help her give a career boost. I'll give for her a career boost. Emma responded, keeping her hidden meaning to herself. I'll hang up then. Let's have dinner. And Athen had no idea that the tables had turned. He was probable sitting at Amber's beside right now. Tenderly watching his secret lover. Emma hung up the phone and called her manager. Nathan wants you to stand in for that B-grade model? Yella Lisa, is he joking? Yella Lisa, if you hadn't stepped away if you hadn't stepped away from the spotlight, she won't even be working. Lisa, I have already agreed Emma replied calmly. Are you really going to do this? Lisa was in anger. Emma had stepped back from her courier. Lisa had been dragged down with her. Emma knew that Lisa just wanted to stick for her. You don't need to worry I won't be stupid. I won't let them use me. Emma are you saying you have a plan? Lisa, from now I'm only trusting you. Can you help me with something? Of course Amber is desperate to convince the media that she's attending the show. Because she doesn't want anything to hurt her chances for the top 10 model awards. Can you help me by paying a visit to the hospital? I see what you're getting at. You want to prove that she was still at the hospital. During the show and revealed it to the public. No, I have even bigger news. She's pregnant, and the child is Nathan's. I want to tell the media that, Nathan has used me over and over to fill in for her during her shows. But I need your help for finding the evidence. Lisa was surprised at first, but quickly understood what was going on. She thought bitterly such a shameless couple of cheats. And they have been using Emma like a puppet. Don't worry Emma you can count on me. Emma unusually calm. She was going to treat them like they had treated her. Emma quickly grabbed her belongings and drove to the venue for the show. To meet with Amber's assistant, Gary, a married man. A muscular physique and a cunning personality. What took you so long, quick, come and get your makeup done. What type of show is it today? Emma asked as Gary hurried down the hallway. Nothing special he replied. On her way there Emma had done some research on the show. She knew that it was far more than nothing special. In fact it was Woolery's show for the famous French brand, Belle Aim. After the show Amber would be able to sign on as Belle Aim's spoke Epperson. Her injuries will keep her from this opportunity, unless Emma filled in for her. Amber's assistant had lied to her. Had she always been this easy to trick, Emma wondered. Because Amber is doing so well. She has her own makeup room. You can use it. Here is the schedule. You'll appear in the grand finale. Presenting this piece of woolery. Said Gary, pointing to the piece she will be wearing. Then he ordered the makeup artist to get started. Did Nathan really think that mask would really hide her identity? Although what she had in mind was a little extreme. Emma was going to give the cheating, couple the surprise of their lives. Meanwhile Eric's assistant Luke had been following Emma's every move. And overheard that she will be filling in for Amber. 
he reported back to Roberts, who ordered Luke to make arrangements, I'm going to the Lurry show he said, make it happen. Yes, Mrs. Roberts, Eric wanted to see his new wife, in action. In the late morning, classical music was playing throughout the halls of the Brooklyn City Center, the show had begun. Emma's makeup was complete. And she was standing in front of the mirror in dressing room. Her dress was white, tight fitting and long. It was simple but elegant. Her beautiful golden mask gave of a mysterious aura. With her hair tied back from her face and with a single white rose, she was absolutely stunning. Gary Amber's assistant was speechless. Even if Emma stands completely still he thought she will be the center of attention. Amber will certainly get the contract now. He told Emma, you will descend onto the stage on a chair that will be from the rafters. This bracelet is the crown star. Let me put it on you. Gary unclasped the bracelet and carefully put it around Emma's wrist. However Emma was slimmer the amber and bracelet was too big. Every little moment of her arm, it slid around the gold bracelet had been designed by the founder of Belaim for his beloved daughter. The crown with diamond was the centerpiece. Stars on either side of it. Like parents protecting their precious child. It's so big, said Gary in a state of panic. How are you going to wear it, do you trust me, Emma said, now I have no other option. Gary said in that case leave it to me. Emma assured. Amid all the emotions the assistant, did not notice, Emma's eyes. Thank you. Did you like the story? Share and subscribe.